So I don't even know what I was getting to. One billion dollar. Well, the point is, is that here it is a number of decades later, and I'm still talking to an audience. Unfortunately for me, America has changed, and everything I was warned about communism in the 50s has come to pass. Everything I was told would happen when communists took over America has happened. But it didn't start with Obama, mind you. See, this is the funny part. It started with Nixon when he took us off the gold standard. I know you don't want to believe this. I remember writing this when Nixon was president in my journal. Yeah, I'm one of those guys. I actually keep a journal, had one. I don't, I don't keep them anymore because the radio show has become an open journal for me. <clears throat> but going back, oh, I don't know, forever, I have boxes of these incredibly well-written journals and beautiful books, handwritten. Maybe I'll auction them off one day. I don't know what I'll do with them, feed them to the seagulls. I don't know, whatever. I remember when Nixon was president that I was apolitical. I wasn't a Democrat or Republican. I was just an American struggling like most Americans. And I said, wait a minute, he's taken us off the gold standard. He's opened up trade with Russia. And I said, wait a minute, I said, with China. I said, everything I was told would happen when communists took over America has happened under Nixon. Now, I know it was considered politically insane at the time because he was so-called, he was a so-called conservative, but little did I know that he was not really a conservative. He was just simply a tool of the giant structure that we are dealing with today who is going to steer us into something we don't even want to go into. It's happening. It's not going to happen. We're already 60 to 65 to 70 percent there, whether or not you want it to have happened. It has happened. And you can't say it can't happen here because it already has happened here. And on that note, I'll take a quick we are playing the music of the dead white male 